Hi guys, I just wanted to do a quick video. Um, I've been having a heck of a time uploading videos lately. So anyway, I wanted to show you some of these shirts I found. I did the video with the toys and stuff. Wasn't a great video, but it gave you a little bit of insight of what was in there. But I wanted to show you some of these shirts because I just washed them and I think they're really cute. Look at this one. Time to wind down. How cute. It's a little small for me, but I'm going to sell it on my Poshmark. I think it's cute. It has the little bling blings. So I like that. Then this one, I don't know if I'm going to try to sell it or just donate it. It's a nice shirt, though. It has a little pocket there with Texas. And then on the back, it says Fredericksburg, Texas, which is a cute little town here in Texas. It has a lot of great antique shopping. So that's the second one. Some of this stuff, when I got it home, had some spots and rips and things, so I'm not going to keep it or do anything with it. These are the ones that I saved. Okay, this says Ball Harbor, Maine. It's a small, but it's really pretty. Nice color and everything, so I wish it fit me, but it's a small. I don't think it's going to fit me, but I'm going to try to sell it on my Poshmark. And then this one would probably fit me, but... I don't know. I'll have to think about it and try it on and see if I want to keep it. It's probably cute for knocking around, but it says Texas State University Bobcats. It's very cute. Nothing wrong with these shirts. Don't have no holes. They don't have no spots. People just throw them in the trash. Okay, this one is really cute. I like this. It says Israel, and it has, I don't know if you can tell, but it has little sparkles in it. But it's a small... I like the color and everything and the cut of it. It's really a cute t-shirt, but I'm not going to be able to wear it. But I will try to sell it on my Poshmark. And then this one is just a basic little tee. I think I've seen these before in the mall at like PacSun or somewhere. It just says Ireland. Cute basic little t-shirt. Guy's t-shirt. I don't know. I guess I could sell it maybe with a couple other. Is it a bundle or something? But okay, so that was some of the stuff that I salvaged. And then here's the toys that I took. I just, I love elephants and I collect elephants. So I had to grab this. He's too cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with him really. Cole's Care, it says, collection. Nancy Tillman. I don't know, but I just thought he was super cute. I'll probably end up giving him to one of my grandkids same with these I just saw that they had the tag on them and they're like brand new spotless so I grabbed these two and I think they're very cute one of them is a little reindeer still got the tag and everything glitzy I looked him up last night I think he's probably worth maybe ten dollars if I really push it because I looked it up on eBay and this one goes between 15 and 20 this is Ozzy and he's a little bigger, really cute bat for Halloween, I think. You see the, he's got the gold on the ears. He's super cute, so hopefully I'll be able to sell him. I'm going to probably, I was going to throw him on Poshmark, but there aren't a lot that I saw on there. So I don't know, I might just put it on Marketplace or something. And then this I didn't get to wash yet because I had washed some other darks with these t-shirts and I didn't want to put this in there with the darks, but. I'll show you because I think it's super cute. Look at this. It's like maybe a kid's young adult's. I guess it's like PJ's, but it says Secret Treasures. I've seen some like these at Walmart. They're kind of like pajamas slash Halloween outfits. It's really cute, though, and not a spot on it. I had one of these before when I was in... Uh, California, I found one that was a chicken's, it was a big chicken suit, and I put it online forever, and nobody ever bought it, I ended up donating it before we left, because I'm trying to make myself rotate things out, like I can't keep everything, so I put them online, if I don't sell them or do something with them after three or four months, then I donate them, because I can't keep everything, you know, okay, so this doll I love. I gotta find a dress or something, but listen to this. I, I was playing it in front of my dogs the other day. They were freaking out. 
I'll have to do a video on that. <laughs> but it cries and coos and really cute. I can't decide if I'm going to give it to my granddaughter or I'm going to try. I'll probably give it to her because I think she'd really like it. So I'm going to try to find a little dress for it somewhere and give that to her. Okay, so that's basically what I found yesterday. Not a whole lot of stuff. I got a couple little aprons that I found. Little small yellow, red, and blue aprons. Have to show you. I haven't got them out of the car yet. I do want to show you this one rug I found the other day. Last Friday, I found this rug in the trash. Isn't it gorgeous? I brought it home and brushed it and uh, swept it a little bit. And it doesn't really match in my bedroom here. My temp, this is my temporary bedroom. We're building another bedroom. But um, it's just such a nice rug. And I did need something in here. So even though it doesn't really match real well, it's in here. So, so I found that. Not a spot, nothing on it. Somebody had thrown it in a dumpster behind a shopping center. And then there was one other thing I wanted to show you guys. What was it? What was it? I found so much stuff lately. I always find stuff when I turn my camera off. It's like catch-22. I found these a while back. I don't know if I showed you these placemats. They're beaded placemats. They have $10 a piece on them. They're gorgeous. One of them is separated and needs to be glued. Like this one, the bottom. Yeah, see it's separated. But I'm just going to take my hot glue gun and glue it back up. But besides that, they're beautiful. Hopefully, I'll be able to put them on my dining room table soon because my other place mats are getting really crappy. This is the bag I found yesterday, too, in the video. I don't know if you saw the video, but only problem is when I got it home, it's got these little holes down here. So probably won't keep it. But I'm using it for my donation bucket sort of thing. See, these are the ones. This is some of the stuff I found that I'm going to donate. This was a book that we that I found yesterday with those t-shirts. But it's got kids' name in it and everything. So I'm just going to donate it. This little doll. I don't know. I just think I'm going to donate it. And then this little truck I found. But it doesn't have the little thing, you know remote but somebody might want it just to play with and then there's a couple of squirt guns in there and these two t-shirts these t-shirts i decided not to keep this one is from mexico some resort in mexico and this one is what is this i don't know some foreign language on it i didn't know so i'm getting rid of it because i don't know what it says <laughs> and then this little kid's shirt cute but i just think golf shores alabama little shirt cute but i just decided to donate so this is my donation pile here i'm using this bag and then after about a week or so i will just bring that and give them all of it so oh here's the other thing i found the other day i don't know if i showed you this found this little christmas light in the box, $5. Cute, I don't know if I'm keeping it, I'm just trying to make a decision so it's sitting here for now. I have to decide what I'm doing with that. Okay, so that's all for today. And I will get back to you guys soon. I hope you're doing good in the pandemic. I hope it's not making you too crazy. And I hope you are getting out a little bit and getting some sunshine. Take care. Bye-bye.